Hello everyone, so in this video I'll be sharing my story of how I made my first 100k in 2 months doing freelancing as a web developer. Alright, let's get right into it. So the first thing that contributed to making this much money was I was working with a trader so you basically wanted a web application to automate the process that he was doing manually. So I basically did some web scraping using Python. So on that we just agreed that he was going to pay me 30,000 but firstly he was going to pay me 1,500 in a week after I actually created the design. So I created the design and presented it to him and he liked the design on the first instance. Then I was started building the actual platform so the functionality and all the features right. So on that he we agreed that he was going to pay me 3,500 in each and every week. Then I was working on the project for two months, so it all added up to 30,000. So the second thing that contributed to this was I provided my web development services to five companies. So I was doing freelancing there. I was building websites for those five companies. So basically they were paying me 3,200 each. So it's just basic websites, not those websites that are much advanced or they need some special features. Basically they pay me 3,200 and on that amount, I'm not including the domain name and all the amounts that they need to pay for these third party platforms like AWS or whatever platform I'll be using to be able to get their site running properly. So I also told them that they actually need to pay monthly on these services to avoid a situation where they're stuck in the long run and they actually don't have anyone around so they will need to pay another person to try to help them figure out what, what the issue is. So I gave them all the information about the platforms that they need to pay periodically like monthly or yearly. On those five companies like I said they were paying me 3200 so it all added up to 16000 So the next one is three companies. Two are actually bloggers so they are people that of going through Instagram so I helped them to actually build them a website where they can do blogging because they were using third-party websites like Medium and all the other ones so I basically helped them to have a main source platform so yeah I built them a blogging website using WordPress. It's much faster instead of actually creating everything from scratch. So I actually charged them also for the SEO and performance optimization. Then the other company is actually is actually a company itself. So they already had a website. So they were just looking for someone who can manage or maintain the SEO and performance optimization for about a month. So it was a one month contract. And in their contract, they agreed to pay me 37,000. So I was just doing SEO and performance optimization related things so yeah like i said the two bloggers i charged them both five thousand each then this company they actually agreed to pay me thirty seven thousand to work for them for a month to do the seo and performance optimization and if you don't know what performance optimization is it's basically helping the website to load much faster because if you go to a website and it loads longer you there's a higher chance that you click off and go to another website or do something else so I help them to have a site that loads much faster so the last thing here is that i was doing teaching so i was teaching high school students some coding so basically i saw a post out they were looking for two people who were free on saturdays to actually teach high school students coding so they agreed to pay both of us 3650 each and every month so i only went there for two months but it was a four month thing so i only went there for two months it all added up to around 7300 so yeah that's the last thing that actually contributed to me making this much money in about two months so in that two in those two months i was just doing everything that i mentioned in this video so basically as you can see you can make money without actually working for a specific company you can just make money doing freelancing providing web development services like helping companies with the designs or if you see a company whose seo is not really that good you can if you are skilled with seo of course you can help them boost their ranking on google using seo skills and help their websites load much faster by boosting those sites performance basically so if you're looking for a job right now and you're not really making any progress don't feel uh discouraged just try and also do some freelancing on the side so it, it keeps you busy right and i'll do a video separately from this so i can help you guys learn more clients because there are methods and tricks or strategies that i've used to actually find this companies right so i'll do a separate video on that to teach you everything that i've learned as i was doing sales because before i actually got a job as a web developer or as a software developer i was doing sales so i've learned some few things 
that help me get these clients so i'll share those tips with you on a separate video but if you're looking for a job just do freelancing you'll be able to make some money on the side and also if you have a job also do freelancing that doesn't stop you from doing freelancing do freelancing so you can have a side hustle basically and add up to the money that you already earn. all right that's it for this video guys if you haven't subscribed yet please make sure you subscribe to my youtube channel so you that my content gets directly to you and hit the bell icon so that you get notified whenever i release new content lastly like this video guys and thank you so much for the support that you've shown me have an awesome day